Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm doing a collab with my really, really good friend here on YouTube, Amy Slayton. We're doing a candy corn Halloween type makeup look. Um, she did an awesome look, so go show her some love on her channel. I'll link her video in the description box below. And let's jump in. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you've been with me, thank you. And if you don't like me or my videos, please don't fucking watch me. I'm not cup of tea and I'm okay with that. Um, I went ahead and did my base on my eyes with the NYX white primer and then I already set it with my normal shit and I'm going to jump in. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put this on real quick. This is the Versali's Rose Gold and then the Unicorn. Um, I'm just going to stick these on so they can see soak into my skin while I'm doing uh, my eyes. So I know you guys might have seen a video. Um, my son got in another car accident today um, and not quite sure whose fault it was. My son was inching out of a driveway slowly he wasn't trying to go he was just inching his way out a little bit he had stopped and somebody came by and smacked him and totaled his car nobody was hurt thank you god but this is two accidents in three days so i'm sure you guys can imagine how crazy i feel right now um, my husband came home from work and pretty much took over um because i kind of had a nervous breakdown i'm really late to this collab so bless amy's heart for being so patient with me um, I love her. I really do. And I hope not to see any hate comments in the, um, comment section. If I get a hate comment, I usually will just pin it and I move on with my life. But if I see anything about Amy, I will remove it because that's not what this is about. I love her. She's been a good friend to me. We talk outside of YouTube and, um, I'm really proud of the look she did. I really am. She did a really great look and I, and I was happy to join this collab. So thank you, Amy, for asking me. I really appreciate it. That's my girl. Um, I've been a long time fan of Amy, so to be able to say I'm her friend feels really awesome. Um, especially because I consider her to be one of my best friends here on YouTube. We talk a lot and I love her so much and I'm proud of how far she's come as a person. So make sure you guys show her some love. She did a she did a great job. I, I'm really I was really impressed. I was like, Amy, go girl. Dang, you get you some. So I have been really wanting to play with these two palettes and I kind of have a little bit here and there. Um, the Dominique Cosmetics um, Lemonade Palette and then her Latte. Um, the Candy Corn is obviously yellow, orange, and white. So I think I'm going to use this and this and then I got a white that I'm going to use and we're going to get started. I think I'm going to do a bit of a halo eye. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. So um yeah so my son's okay my husband's taking him back up to the emergency room to get checked out um I don't think it was his fault but right now I honestly can't say we'll just have to see um what the insurance companies think either way he had full coverage he owns his car outright but we still kept full coverage on it for him so he'll he'll be fine uh, I'm just thankful he's not hurt and the lady who uh he was in the accident with wasn't hurt so I, you know, I'm thankful for that. That's, that's really all I can be thankful for. No, nobody was hurt regardless of whose fault it was. And, um, my son asked me to take the video down off my YouTube and out of respect I did because he just said, I, I don't want that on there right now. Um, he didn't say I couldn't talk about it. He just said, Hey, would you take that video down? He just heard how upset I was and he just didn't want that on there right now. Plus I know some of his friends watch my channel and um, just out of respect, I took it down. So I love my kid more than anything and I'll always do what he needs me to do. Um, so my husband said, yeah, just take it down and you can talk to everybody about it. That's fine. Just take it down. And I was like, okay, I will. Um, I do like that, but it's not as yellow as I want it to be. So I'm going to go into my Natasha Denona Sunset Palette and grab this yellow. And I'm just going to go over that just to brighten it up a little bit. Yeah, I don't know. It's making it look more orange on camera than yellow, but it is yellow. Y'all just have to trust me. <laughs> I wouldn't lie to you. Um, then I'm going to do pretty much a halo look, I think. And I got my Sephora package today, um, so I'm excited. I got all of the... Well, I got... Let's start with... The, I got Natasha Denona Mini Star Palette, which I thought was really cute. Um, that's a great little palette to get any of the little minis for 25 bucks. That's not bad. It's a great way to try Natasha Denona's formula, um, without spending, you know, $129 a palette like my stupid ass does. But, um, 
I mean, these are staples in my collection and I love them, so I, I can't complain. Um, and then I got, let's see, I got the star palette and then I got all five of the uh, Huda Beauty Precious Stones palettes. So I think I'm going to try to pair these up with some of the Stila, the new Stilas I got. Um, and see if I can create some looks with each palette. Um, I'm going to need some stuff to keep myself busy or I'm going to go freaking nuts. This I've just, I've had, I've had a rough week. I can't even imagine how my kid feels right now. He's, he's super shooken up. He was crying. So bless his fucking heart. And she, the lady was so sweet and she was just like, you have such a sweet kid and I'm so sorry. And I'm like, yeah, thank you. You know? Um, all right. So I went in with mango. I'm going to try to go in with sweet tea. Uh, my dogs are being jerks today, so hold on a second. Let me pause and tell them to stop. Eh, we'll see. I told them to be quiet. We'll see how long it lasts. So I haven't tried these shades yet um, together, so we're going to see. We're going to go in with Sweet Tea and build us a little bit of a halo. So, yeah, today, this week, it's only Wednesday, dude. It's only fucking Wednesday, and... Everything has just gone bad. Also, uh, the Outlander that my son was driving, our old SUV, um, we had to park it in the back of the park I live in, and it got hit. My husband was taking my son, my son's, we had our son, my son's car towed home, um, just for right now, and we went to take it to put it in our back spot, and then let him use the Outlander, and somebody had hit it and broke the fucking um, rear or the rear brake lights. Sorry, I'm having trouble thinking, guys. Um, and dented my bumper. So I'm going to have to talk to the owner and find out whose spot was next to mine. Um, and then we're going to have to go around the neighborhood and see who the fuck matches up with the color left on the car because the idiot left the fucking color on the car. So that was just lovely. My shit comes in three. So <laughs> apparently my son's luck is coming in threes as well. When I have something ha bad happen, it's always in threes. Um, it's, it's a curse I've been my whole life. You ask anybody who knows me, I'm cursed with threes. So I think my son is having that as well, sadly. <laughs> Man, it has been a day, dude. I have just lost my fucking mind today. I have truly lost my mind. Um, I'm going to go in with that mango color again and just blend around the edges a little bit. It's turning more into an orange look, which I don't want. So hopefully, the shade won't. This uh, sweet tea won't take over too much. But fuck. Mm, yeah, it's gonna be a really easy look. I was gonna do something with a white eyeliner. Um, I, my hands are too shaky right now, and I'm too phew, to even fuck with that. So I went ahead and did both eyes. Um. So I think I'm gonna put this. Um. Ofra Cosmetics Nikki Tutorials thing and Glaze Donut on the center of my lids. And I'm going to take this new Cover Effects White Cream um, Concealer. And it has the weirdest little ball. Um, I don't even want a lot. I just want a little bit. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, well, maybe we're getting a lot. I don't fucking know. I just need to calm down. But playing with makeup calms me down. I feel weird being on here after such a bad thing happened. But my kid was like, go do your video, mom. Go calm down. Um, my husband said, you know, came home from work way early. He literally just walked out of work and came to my kid. <laughs> I, I literally got a phone call that he was in an accident. And I just took off again, just like Monday. And pulled up and was in tears. And... <sighs> I need a break, God. So I keep telling God, give me a little bit of a break. I don't ask for much in life, but give me a fucking break. So he's home and he's going to help with my son. Um, and I'm just, they just asked me to come in and calm down for a little bit. So that's what I'm going to do. And playing with makeup does that for me. But I definitely wanted to let you guys know, sorry I took that video down, but my son asked me to. And, you know, he means more to me than anybody, so... My two kids are my entire life. Uh, my oldest one, I don't talk about him a lot because he's always gone and busy, but he, I have such a good 21 year old. Oh my God, you guys have no idea. I, I have such good kids. I'm so very proud of them. 
my son was, you know, today at the accident, he was crying. He was really worried about the, the older lady and, you know, he was just heartbroken that this happened. His car's totaled. It's gone. Um, for those of you that saw the video, I'm sure you can see it's, it's dead. He's going to have to get a new one. So I hope it's not his fault. I mean, he doesn't, I don't feel like it was either because he wasn't trying to pull out in front of her. He was just inching his way out because there was cars lined up against the street and she just came around and binked him. And she said the same thing. So I don't know. We'll have to see where it takes us. Um, I'm going to go in with that Nikki tutorials. Um, I'm not going to set that uh, color or the concealer. Sorry. Excuse me if my words are screwed up. Yesterday when I was telling you guys about the dogs, I said kitties and cats. That's where my mind's been lately. Um, I have mental illness and um, my brain is always very busy anyway. So when I get stressed, it's the same thing. I get tired. I get worn out quick from my physical shit and my brain just doesn't work for me the way it should. So I'm sorry if that confused any of you yesterday. I felt so stupid when I was watching that back. Um, Becca MS Fighter had pointed it out and I was like, oh my God, I feel so stupid. <laughs> So, sorry about saying cats when I meant dogs and kitties instead of puppies. I just, you know, it's been one of those weeks. I'm just, normally I wouldn't be on online when I'm like this just because my brain short circuits <laughs> and I don't do that great with stress. Um, I can handle it and I boss bitch it, but I still struggle. So, all I can say is I'm just thankful my kid is okay and no one was hurt. And uh, I still, we're still having him checked out just because that's the right thing to do. And I want to make sure that he is 100%. He's so young, you never know. Just two accidents in a week is a lot for a young person. So I'm going to take that uh, sweet tea color and kind of blend it in. I should have tapped out that concealer a little bit better and I didn't. So that's my fault. But that's okay. I don't expect this to be perfect. If you're here from Amy's channel, sorry. Sometimes I do good makeup, sometimes I don't. <laughs> but I wanted to honor my um, commitment and I'm I'm super late. We were supposed to be uploading. I woke up late too. I woke up late and then I got a phone call and I ran out the door. I didn't even think about it and just <sighs> shit show for real. My life is a shit show right now. I just thank God no matter what, that my kid's okay. I could handle anything as long as my kids are okay. I'll take on anything. I'd rather take their pain anyways, so I'm just thankful it's, they're not hurt. Never, you know, he's not hurt. He's okay. He's going to be okay. My husband was like, you got to calm down a little bit. You're freaking Corey out. And I'm like, I know this is just, it was just a lot, a lot. You know, I'm mama bear. Those, those two boys mean everything to me. And I can't stand the thought of them suffering. You know, I know my kids have to suffer in life, but it, it ain't easy to, to watch it happen. He loved that car so much. And my husband just bought him new tires and rims and changed it and got it all going great. And it's gone, unfortunately. So hopefully he'll get a better car. You know, we, that's why we have full coverage on all of our vehicles. So... It's just crazy. Two in a week, you know what I mean? What the fuck? Two in, two in accidents in just two days. Monday, we had yesterday off, and then Tuesday. Or Monday, and then Wednesday, sorry. See, my brain's just out there. I shouldn't even be on here doing a video, but... I just need to let the makeup help me calm down. And I'm okay, and he's okay, everybody's okay. I'm sometimes a lunatic, so... All right, I'm going to put that same color uh, as a brow bone highlight real quick before I forget. All right, oops. Actually, there we go. Okay, so it's going to be such a basic, simple look, you guys. I'm sorry I had something a little bit better planned, but I literally am just too shaky um, to do it. So this is going to be the most basic easy fucking look I've probably ever done <sighs> sorry guys I know you guys are gonna say don't say sorry but I do feel bad I do care all right 
this isn't blending as good as I want and I'm over it. So it's going to look chalky. I don't fucking care. I'm already 15 minutes in and that was way too basic. Um, okay. I am going to now, whoa, let's not move the cameras there. Let's do some eyeliner. I normally wouldn't do both eyes either. Well, I started not doing both eyes. I'm going to use NARS. Um, this is a liquid eyeliner and we are going to, I'm going to do one eye real quick and then pause and finish off the other eye because this is taking too long. And I'm already 15 minutes in, almost 16 minutes in. So, yeah. All right. And then I'm going to take this NARS Climax um, mascara. And I need to touch up that centerpiece, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm just going to stick lashes over it anyways. She had such a creative, awesome look. I love the look that Amy did on her channel. Very cool. Amy's getting so good at makeup. I'm really proud of her. She's been practicing a lot, so um, it just kills me when I see people giving her a hard time. When, damn it, she has her own YouTube channel. She's just here having fun. You know, it ain't that fucking serious. I don't know why people gotta be mean like that, you know? Like, especially people with no, no pictures and no nothing on their fucking thing. You know what I mean? Like, whatever. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use Goddess Lashes by Tarte. I'm going to pause real quick, finish off these eyes, and I'll be right back. Okay, I did take a little bit of the um, Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitters in Glam Rock, and I stuck it in the middle just to zhuzh it up a little bit. Um, next, I'm going to do primers. Um, so in my order today... Oh, shit. God damn it. I'm losing stuff. Um, in my order today... Um, I ended up getting a sample tester size of the Guerlain Lower um, face primer. Um, I wanted to try this before I bought it just because I do have the Saint Laurent one. Um, so I'm going to stick this on too. I heard it's really good for tightening up and I probably want, am going to buy it. I just have held off for so long. I don't know. I do like the way it smells though. So that's cool. Definitely be using that in the future. I'll probably just order it because I know myself pretty well. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what I just lost down there. Probably the <clears throat> eyeliner I needed. I'm going to use this for Solly's. Um, this is the Skin Blur. And um, I was just shaking it up a little bit. It does have a cum-like texture. Um, I said that in my last video when I used it, but I actually do like it. So... Um, I felt like it does do what it says. Not not crazy, not like the Tatcha, but it does. You know, it's really got good, great skin benefits too. So that's why I like a lot of the Versali stuff. My face, just from using the Rolls Gold stuff, feels so much more hydrated. And I have very dry skin. So I can already tell a difference just in that, how good it feels. Okay, and then I'm going to take just a tiny bit of my Tatcha because I can't live without it. And I'm not going to do a lot just because it's getting so late. So I'm just going to stick a little right here. And then that's probably it. Normally I go in a lot more ham. Um, I'm going to show you what I'm going to use for foundation. I'm going to pause real quick and do that because nobody needs to see that. I'm going to use the NARS. This is the All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. It's really water. I need to shake it up. And I'm going to mix it with my NARS Longwear Radiant. And I'll be right back. All right, so I went ahead and put that foundation on, and now we are going to move on to um, under eyes. So I'm going to take this NARS Radiant Concealer, and we're going to stick her under here. I'm getting low on this one. I use this a lot. <laughs> I love this one. I just like hydrating ones. I was a big Shape Tape fan, but I always still went back to this one a lot. Um, just like the new, oh, look what it's doing. It's taking off my, I have troubles with my nose. Who else has trouble with their nose? Look at that. Like the wand is taking my shit off because it doesn't have enough product on it. Come on, give me a little bit more. A little bit more. Oh, shit. Oh, well. Okay. It is what it is. I'll live. Um, this will help, though. See, it always take. I always have, everything goes off my nose. That's crazy. I've tried mattifying primers on there and everything. Like, I've tried a lot. 
Uh, there's a lot of times I do my makeup and I don't do videos, so I, I mean, I fuck with makeup almost every single day. If my face is fucked up, then I mess with my eyeshadow, and I'll just sit and play an eyeshadow, you know what I mean? Like, I'm always doing something with makeup. All right, well, this is one of the things I got today um, in my Sephora thing. I'm not going to do a haul video. It was just, like, a few things. So, um, this is the Laguna Liquid Bronzer. It's very watery, which is a little concerning. So hopefully it won't be a hard to work with. We'll see. I'm not going to wet my brush this time just because it is so liquidy. Um, but I want to see. Oh yeah, it does something. Okay, okay. I love cream products. Um, you guys might not see a big difference with the cream products, but in real life, I absolutely do. Um, I notice it big time when I don't use them. So... I just notice my makeup wears off quicker in certain areas and it breaks up. And when I do cream products and then I set it all and then use powder, it really does last longer. So I really like that. I'm just doing little tiny dollops because it, it is kind of liquidy. The liquid bronzer, right? Yeah. But I'm just doing a little here. I wanted to try this. I've been wanting it for a while. And I always waited for it to come into Sephora and then one day they told me, Oh no, it's only online. And then I realized, oh, it does say online only. Fucking Sarah. Um, but I do like that. So cool, cool, cool. Um, and then I'm going to do cream contour. I'm just going to use my Anastasia um, little cream contour and fawn. Um, they don't have, NARS don't have a cream contouring product. So um, there was a couple things that I don't have from NARS. Um, to make it a full NARS video, but I'm working on it, slowly but surely. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take my normal contour brush. I'm just gonna spray a little bit uh, with that. Same thing as always, same spiel. I love the smell of that. <laughs> and this blends out super easy as well. I think Katie's going live soon, so I need to get this uploaded and get ready in case she needs me to help mod. I don't know. Maybe. And I'm going to use this cream, or liquid, sorry, liquid um, blush by NARS. This is in Luster. Same thing, just sticking them on the back of my hand. Um, NARS products are pretty liquidy. I guess I never really noticed that, but. I mean, I guess I did with this. I mean, it's not as creamy, or it's not as liquidy as the bronzer was. That was very liquidy, watery, but I might need to shake it up more too and play with it. I literally just got it out of the box and started recording with it, so I don't know yet, but so far so good. I don't I don't hate it. I don't know. I'll have to play with it more for sure. Let's blend that in a little bit better, girl. There we go. And then I'm going to take my beauty blender again and just go over and make sure that don't go too crazy over here. I always end up, because I have such a small little area right here, I always end up with it on the like my upper lip. It's like I don't have the right proportion face. I'm going to go ahead and use this Liquid Frost by Jeffree Star. And I am going to very carefully... Dab, even though I know you're supposed to push it, I don't want as much as going to come out. So I'm trying not to do that. But you're actually, it has a little dropper and you're supposed to drop it. And to me, it just gives too much product out at once. So it's only my only complaint. Okay, there we go. All right, that'll do. All right, and now I'm going to set everything. Um, I'm going to use my MAC powder real quick. Blend these eyes just one more time. I'm going to try to look up. But I'm going to end up looking down because I always do. I just did it. See? Can't help it. Um, let's take the beauty blender and grab this powder and stick it under. I'm not going to go too heavy today. Like I said, it's getting so late. Um, just enough to set everything. I'll probably wear the makeup for a little bit. I need to get out. Uh, as soon as I'm done with this, I need to call and check on my kid with my husband and see what they're going to do at the emergency room. Whoa. 
Might be might, might be my oldest son coming home, so sorry guys. I wish they wouldn't do this, but they do. Hey guys, quiet. Hold on a minute. Okay. I think they're done. Okay. I said, please. Please be quiet. Ooh. Oh, Lord have mercy. They're going to bark for a minute. Sorry, guys. Can't win to save my life. Hold on. Okay. Sorry, guys. They're good now. Um, let's see, what else? And then I think I'm gonna set my face with this uh, MAC Studio Fix Powder. This is a very, I wouldn't say full coverage powder, everybody says that, but I don't agree. Um, but it is a foundation powder, so it will work. Um, if you have really good skin and you don't need foundation, this is a great product just to keep, you know, if you're oily or anything. Um, I love this for multiple reasons. Set the rest of my face. That will work. And then we're going to go in and bronze real quick. I'm going to take this Laguna bronzer by... Or no, this isn't Laguna. This is Seaside. Sorry. Uh, by NARS. And load her up because she don't show up that good. This is a very subtle bronzer. I feel like I have to really bright bronze it up. I should have got my other one. That's okay. We're just doing a light one today anyways. Alright. And then I'm going to go in with my contour real quick. And I'm gonna, I want to use a few new products today, so I am. I'm going to use this new MAC um, contouring palette. And I'm going to go in and mix these two lighter shades right here together. Gonna be dark, I feel like. Oh no, not too bad. Okay. Oh, that's not bad at all. Okay. Oh, okay. I know you're supposed to only bring it out to your eye, but the way my face is shaped, I just kind of do it how I want. Alright. I'm gonna carefully get along my jaw. I'm just gonna take the lighter one along my jaw. Okay, that'll do. And then we're going to do blush, and I'm going to finish these under eyes real quick, which will be pretty simple, I think. Let me move some of this stuff out of my way real quick. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, it's dropping. Shit, nothing I can do. Oh, well. Um, I'm going to take this NARS Cystic. I'm not going to be able to say that right. Palette. I'm going to go into this one and very lightly between those two, I think. I don't even know if I'm going to use that darker one or not. Look at all the powder I got all over me. I think I'm just going to use this orangey one. Never mind. Is it going to let me get away with it? Oh, yeah. Okay. That looks peak to you guys, but it's orange in real life. It might have some leftover remnants from yesterday, too. I didn't clean this off, so. Blush is blush. Fuck it. I don't. Blend everything together. Whoa, that was a lot of blush. Maybe I did it too much. Mm, fuck it, I don't even care. Fuck it. We're gonna look. It's Halloween. We can look silly, right? Let's finish these under eyes real quick. So I am gonna take my. Where'd she go? This is a Marc Jacobs um, highliner in Orange Crush, and I need my shit. A little mirror and I'm gonna lay this down first and I'm gonna try to keep it out of my waterline because I'm gonna use a white in my waterline so as best as I can just to help the powder stick I like this trick it works really well um, for colored eyeshadow under the eyes if you can find you I mean there's cheaper versions of this you don't have to get this particular one I just like all of the, the ones he puts out so um, okay, I'm going to take Sweet Tea again, and I'm going to go ahead and set that real quick, if I can get my little life together fast enough. There we go. i got to clean these brushes off because I used them yesterday, and they probably have the wrong colors underneath them. All right, so, ooh, that was a lot. Okay, let's 
reset that real quick. There we go. Okay. There we go. I was going to kind of blend it a little bit real carefully. There we go, real carefully. There we go. And then I'm going to take another brush and go in, oops, wrong one, to Mango, which was that yellow-ish one. It's a little bit deeper of a yellow. I wouldn't say mustard, but like brighter. Like a mango, I guess, right? I don't eat mango, so I don't quite know what they look like or can't quite remember exactly, but I picture something like this. I have a fly. I have a fly in my house bothering me. That's what I get from leaving the door open. Okay. We're just going to finish this up. and We're going to be okay today, Sarah. It's been a rough week, dude. Jesus. I'm pretty fucking tough girl, but I think we all have our breaking points, right? I definitely um, have been tested this week. All right. Well, I'm sorry if you guys can't see the yellow. Uh, she's there. She's just blending in super deep with that fucking orange. So that's my candy corn look. I, I did my best, guys. <sighs> sorry if it's not that great. Um... And then I'm going to take a white eyeliner. I think I have a NYX one for white. Oh, come on. Ish, don't fuck with me. Where are you? All the way at the bottom of my little thing. I'm going to take this NYX white eyeliner in white. Blanc. I'm going to stick it in here. Oh, that's because I'm trying to do as many colors as I can as a candy corn. And it is working. I always forget to get the white one from Eric Jacobs when I go in. I'm going to have to grab that one. And grape is the other one I'm missing. Um, okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and do the inner corner highlight real quick with this the glazed donut. And I'm going to put a lot so that it, you know, adds that white that I need for the candy corn look. Oh, that was a lot. Oh, that was a lot. Okay, well, now we're going heavy. Fuck it. Okay. Good enough. Good enough. It's pretty. It'll work. All right. I'm going to spray my face. I'm going to put a little bit. Actually, I might use that one too. I don't know yet. Smack Fix Plus. Okay. And then I am going to. Oh, I need to do my lower lashes. I'm going to add Lyra from the Anastasia Aurora palette. It's like an orangey kind of color. Um, I'm going to put that up here. See, we got a little bit of an orange tint. And I'm just going to go lightly. Like I said, I'm not going to wear this for too long. So. Okay. And then I'm going to grab the Ofra one and go on top because more is more. Because I like more. Okay, that'll do. And then I'm going to go ahead and do my lipstick real quick and my lower lashes. So I'm going to use my MAC Giga Black real quick um, for my lower lashes. Oh, I just inked that right into my eyeball. Ow. I did not feel good. I hate when I get mascara on my actual eyeball. I always think, like, oh my god, I'm going to get cancer or something from this one day. Good lord. And then I dinked myself right there, and I touched it, which is a big no-no. Watch it. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Where did you go? I need you. Thank you. Oops. I uh, tried to clean it up before it dried. That's not always the best idea, but we can fix it. There we go. Okay. That'll work. Okay. And then um, the lipstick I'm going to use, well, I'm going to use this lip liner um, in, I don't know how to say this one, Stealth, sorry, Buxton. Okay, and then I'm going to go in with Coral Fixation, or Coral Corruption, sorry, by Wet n Wild. I 
I didn't have, I had a NARS, uh, damn it, I had a NARS orgasm lip gloss I should have grabbed and I completely forgot. I'm going to go in with Jeffree Star's um, Soft Serve on top. That don't totally match at all, but I don't care. And then I'm going to take a little bit of this um, Cover Effect Setting Spray. There we go. Now I'm moving it around. Oh, right here. There we go. It's got a little bit of a shimmery glitter. And this is my Candy Corn Halloween makeup collab with Amy Slayton. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, sorry I'm so fucking off. Like I said, I just wanted to get this done and I appreciate Amy's patience. Everybody who collabs with me, something always comes up and fucks my shit up, dude. I'm just, I'm a mom first <laughs> and that always, uh, you know, puts me on the back burner, which, you know, I'm okay with that. That's my life. That's, um, I'd rather it be that way anyways. It's nice to have YouTube as a hobby and something to do, but it can never come before my kids or my husband, so, you know, that's just the way I keep it. Um, so that is my candy corn look. Sorry, you guys can't see the yellow that good, but it's there. Um, I love y'all. Um, please go check out Amy. I'll link her in the description box below. Thank you, Amy, for inviting me to do this collab. I really do appreciate it. I love y'all. Be good to each other. Peace.